Hi, uh, Marvel and Liao here at DesignCon 2025. So he, today we have to show about PCIe Retimer and Marvel's PCIe technology. So the first demo we have is a PCIe Gen 6 Retimer. Here you can see three boards stacked together. We do have one of the bottom board that we use as a PCIe root complex and the upper board we use as a PCIe endpoints. And what we are really demonstrating here is the middle board which acts as a PCIe retimer. You can see it comes with the industry package as a rectangular package size which is easy to fit into uh, on board server design or it can also be integrated into uh, the internal cable or connector. Uh, so this actually is a working, it's a live demo that transmit and receive the PCI Gen 6 uh, from one end to the other. And we also have a new demo here. It's a static demo. It's a, a PCIe adding car that has our PCI Gen 6 retimer right uh, underneath the passive heat sink. And this is to showcase the uh, PCIe Gen 6 signal can go uh, out of the server chassis through a riser card's help. And this one is PCIe um, golden fingers into CDFP connector going out. The cable distance can range from one meter through three meters. That can cover across the system chassis in the rack. And then the second station we have is a PCIe Gen 7 service demonstration. Here we have our uh, Marvel in-house PCIe Gen 7, 128 giga transfer per second, run. Uh, uh, processing by the 3 nanometer TSMC technology. So this can give us lower power, better performance, and running at double the speed of PCIe Gen 6. So we have two Certis chip here. It's the same chip. It has the Gen 7 Certis uh, built into the chip. And what we have is outside the chips are all the paths interconnect through the different cable connector to the QSFP DD MCB and through a 2.5 meter DAC cable, 30 gauge. To the other end, the same thing symmetric to back to our Gen 7 Certis. So with this setup, we can demonstrate in Marvel's PCI Gen 7 service performance. Uh, you, if you can zoom in, you can see the uh, the Gen 7 service. We are observing bit error rate about e to the minus nine, e to the minus ten. So that's a multitude of what uh, the PCI SIG has been defined e to the minus six. So this is what we have. Thank you for watching.